Hey everyone, today's video is of the Zoo Plus haul that I said I would do ages ago. And um, I'm sorry I haven't done it sooner. You know, it's been about two or three weeks since I last did a video. And I really do apologise for that, but I've been really busy and I haven't had time to find, you know, to do videos and put them on YouTube. So, anyway, I'll do this video now. So this is the video that I said I'd do on my other video of a smaller haul I had. I did. And um, this is of the Hamps Heaven pens and the toys I got to fill the Hamps Heaven pens and the Deegan Musee I think I told you about on my last video. The Deegan Musee is obviously I haven't got it on the bed or anything. It's over there and I've used most of it up. But I'll show you it anyway because I've got a bit left. But first I'll do... The Haps to Heaven pens. They've got all the toys in here, so don't worry. Anything that I would have shown you on the haul, um, you know, it's in the pen now, except for the Deku food, which is over there. Just in my storage where I keep all my food for the animals. So, anyway, I'll begin this video. So, as you can see, it's Haps to Heaven pen. It's got the penthouse, it's got the ledges and everything. And um, I'll show you my Eva first. I don't think you've seen her before. She's really sweet. She's a brown sable, I think. Anyway, she's half asleep. Do little girl. Don't mean to wake you. So if her nose looks red, it isn't. It's just the camera light. So it looks quite red, but it isn't. Hello, are you going to show yourself? Come on. Oh, <laughs> I love the little paws. Hello? Come to have a look. Pretty girl. She's really sweet. She loves all the space. All the new. Whoops, sorry girl. I need to jump then. I'll close this up. I don't want to disturb her. She looks quite sleepy still. I don't want to wake her up from her sleep. So she can just carry on sleeping. And I love these hemp pens because they've got such wide doors. It's so easy to get the hamsters in and out and also to clean it. Because you, as you know, hamsters have to spot clean them. So first I start off with the wheel. This is just, I don't know the company, oh, minute. so it's a Savit wheel. And yeah, it's just a wheel. They really do enjoy using the wheels. So I always make sure I provide it, even if they don't like using wheels. Just so if they change their mind, they can just have a little jog. Here is the next thing. This is a log roll. And as you see, its main use is to help the hamster or help Eva to get on to a wheel because the base, as you can see here, is quite high. So if I didn't have that log roll, she'd have some difficulty getting to a wheel. The next thing is these two boxes. They're just old boxes. This is an old one lock box, and this is an old box which that came in. And I cut a hole in both of them and she stored it. She used it as a house. She's got a little slide, which she loves using that in the morning. She loves sliding down the ladder. And there she's got her little house. She doesn't really use that, doesn't sleep in it. She tends to sleep in here and then she uses that one down here as her food storage area. And then down here she's got a half bitten up. I can't remember what they're called, but they're edible houses. I'll try and get down here with the, over the camera focus. Is it? Oh, there you go. Good. Here is an edible house which is completely demolished. I don't know if you've seen them, but the pets at home and they've got like hay or straw on the top. But they, my hamsters, they always rip the straw off. And then it's just. It's useless unless they have a little nibble of them sometimes. Here's a crinkle tube you can't see. But I have one in there, which I'll show you in a minute. This is Margot's pen, this one. I'll show you that in a minute because you can see it better in there. They have most of the same thing in each pen. And um, that is her wooden bridge. She uses it to get from that place to that place. Oh, and those are all um, houses. This one... I use as a bathroom, so she's got two bathrooms, and that one I sometimes put some, um, what do you call it, actually I don't really, actually I put some bedding in there so she can drag it up to her hut. Oh. 
it's quite hard to get out. Oh, she's going down. Are you coming out? Where's she going? She comes. I'll show you in a moment when she gets out. And then the next one, I have to turn around quickly, sorry. Just turn around. Oh. Margot's in bed, so I'll show her. Here she is. She is a piebald, I think. She's either a piebald or something else, but I've forgotten where else she could be. But she's like a little badger. She's really sweet. I love her little rings around her eyes. She's very pretty, but she's very lively and she'll come out if I let her, as you can see. I don't want her... Oops, sorry, bubs. Don't worry, I didn't catch her face. There we go. And, um... Yeah, she's very lively. She's very sweet. I really love her. Hello, Marg. <laughs> she's a lovely little girl. And here's a Will. The same as... Same company. Same wheel as the other one. Oh, look. Hello. She's got such cute little expressions. <laughs> she's watching Margot in her little penthouse. Here's the same wheel. And then she's got a log rail, same as Eva. And then she's got a, a bridge as well. I think it's, I don't think it's the same. It's slightly smaller. Sorry, you just saw my hand. It's slightly smaller than that one. But it's just used as, you know, to help her get up and off that platform. Then she's got a little wooden ledge. And she's got a food bar down there, which is empty. I'm sorry, but, sorry, I mean, I feel I haven't fed her yet. So, I mean to feed her in a minute. But she always takes all her food up there. As you can see, she's got all her food in there, so. She always takes it up to her bed to eat it. And then she's got a crinkle tube there. Oh, here she comes. Oh, I've watched them go down the wheels. The, the tubes. Why do I keep saying wheels? And then, yep, she's got a crinkle tube. This is what you can see in Eva's pen. It's shoved at the back. She's moved it down there. And she's got a slide the same platform and then she's got a little house the same as Eva's only red and she's got her toilet the cardboard box which came with the toilet and she's got a cardboard tube top tube and then she's got a green well it was green cardboard tube which I got from Pets Home and it was green but she's completely shredded nearly every last scrap of green that was on there and I just want to watch it coming down the tube because it's so cute. Here she comes. Hello. You come down to say hello. Hello. She might come out in a minute. So, yeah. And there's a food, there's other food bowl. She doesn't really use that. It just came with a pen. I don't want to fall down the hole where it was. Oh, she is. Hello. Mm. See, she loves climbing, so she might have more climbing stuff than Eva because she's more of a hamster which likes to play with things on the ground. Hello. She's very lively. Oh, she's going to jump. Don't hurt yourself. Look, there's a little bridge there. That's how I put it in for you to get on and off easy. Oh, what's she going to do? There you go. So that is... um. That is even Margaret's Hampstead Heaven basically and all the stuff I got from them. A few bits I got from their other pens, which sure are the old ones. But most of them I got were new. As you can see it's nice and clean and she hasn't wrecked it all yet. She's waiting for her dindins. She's a very lovely little girl. I think she wants a card as well. I'll give it to her after the video. Because it's very hard to hold a hamster, especially when she's lively as her while well, doing video. Anyway, yeah, they have water bottles as well. But, yeah, as you can see, don't worry, they don't sit on the bed all the time. Of course, they have no place to sleep. They go up here. This is where they normally are. It's nice and sunny up there, because today, today is really nice and hot today. And they can get all the sunshine. Yep, as you can see, that's a uh, Hamp 7 Pens. I'm sorry it took so long to do it. And um, now I'm going to show you, like I said before, 
the Degu food. And it's in this little container up here where I keep all the food. And um, the old food is like this. But they still eat it. It's like a supplement. I use that as um, a supplement to that food. So I'm taking so long to say everything. Here is the plain food. It's just Pets at Home own brand. It's not, I suppose it's not the nicest food compared to others, but they like it and, you know, it's alright just plain food. But this is what they normally, I you know, I normally try to get them and put it in their, you know, that food as well. So it's a nice little supplement. And I think it also can be used as a main food. That's the packet. Well, it was the packet. I've just ripped that off to remember what it is. And I think it can be used as a plain, you know, food in its own. But the degus they tend to, to fight over things if they're in a bowl. If it's in a bowl, you know, they detect it, as most degus tend to do. And here it is. It's really nice. It's actually got lots of oats and grains. It's actually, there's more in there than I thought there would be. Apple, carrot, sorry, not apple. And it's got, I think there's no bit of aubergine. And then some rings, like little grains and plain food in there. They've got little banana shaped grains. Um, little beetroot bites and everything. It's a really nice mix. And I'll basically show you the rabbits quickly because I know lots of people have, well not lots of people sorry somebody said that they want to see more films of the rabbits more videos of them I don't show enough of them Jason is on the bed he is saying hello to the hamsters I don't let him come too near him but he's friends with all the hamsters watching him he say hello he loves he's a big softie he's really you know gentle with them and they love him back, I think. And he comes out, every time I hold them, I don't let him get too close. Obviously, you can't really trust a big animal with a small one. I don't think you'd disagree, though, wouldn't you? But, you know, he's really gentle with them. He doesn't make any attempt to try and bite them. Also, obviously, you know... Whoops. I'm running off. So my camera's having a really bad time focusing. So it might be blurry. Because the sun is shining through and in some parts it's quite shady. So, oh, it's, it's, fo it's not focusing now, sorry, a minute. Ah, oh, it's not focusing, a minute. I'll just keep it still a minute. Come on, focus. Ah, oh, sorry, it's not focusing at all. But as you can see, oh, it's quite blurry. Patch is basically the same. Here's Jenna. Can you come in the light, Jen? I can't see you very well in there. <laughs> mm. You enjoying that? They've got some new hay as well. I forgot to show you that. I didn't get this from Zoo Plus, but oops, cuddly toy then. I did get this, which is I put it in the light. I can't see. It. Oops, Jace is trying to get it now. Sorry, this video. Oops, is not going very well. There it is. It's XL. Dried barn grass. They love it. So they're nibbling on that if you want to put a nibbling on. I'll give you some in a minute, Jason. He's going to be trying to climb on me now. See? Whoop. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. And um, sorry for the blurriness, the unsteadiness, and. Um, where I sometimes stutter my voice. And I sometimes forget to complete my sentences. I'm sorry about that. And that's the room of the rabbits. See, I just, I completely got off the subject. I just forgot to show you. That's what it looks like now. Cobble box and all that. It's completely a bit different from when you last looked at it. Oh, it's camera. Sorry, it's blurry. Oh. I think it's the light. It's just light shade. doesn't mix very well with my camera. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, oh, thank you to all the likes and views I've got on my other videos. I really do appreciate it. And all the nice 